1749, Father Junipero Serra petitioned this Franciscan providential for permission to become a missionary. After having served as a theological teacher for 10 years on the island of Majorca off the coast of Spain, he wrote, All my life I have wanted to be a missionary. I have wanted to carry the gospel teachings to those who have never heard of God and the kingdom he has prepared to them. He received permission to sail from Mexico where he worked among the natives native population for 20 years. Father Sarah and 15 other Franciscan missionaries accompanied, accompanied the army. In the ensuing years, Father Sarah founded nine of the 21 California, California missions. Many of these later became cities such as San Diego, San Gabriel, St. Louis Obispo, San Francisco, San Juan, Capistrano, St. Clara, San Benavarchua, and St. and San Carlos Monterey Romero. During the 15 years of his California apostolate, he had to confront the military and the civil authorities concerning the mistreatment of the Native Americans. He presented a memorandum of 32 points of to the viceroy of the improvement of the situation, some of which were implemented and some not. Despite having a chronically ulcerated leg, Father Sarah visited his numerous missionaries many times. He baptized and confirmed thousands of Native Americans. While he was concentrated on their spiritual needs, he did not ignore their material ones. The new converts were taught methods of farming, raising cattle, and arts and crafts. In this way, they were helped to move from their nomadic past to a stable domestic way of life. His extensive factual reports of his missionary actions reveal a man who loves his people. In 1987, when Pope John Paul II planned to be beatified Father Sarah, a protest was raised by some Native Americans, who argued that the Spanish soldiers and missionaries tried to eradicate the language, culture, and the identity of the people of Cal in California. The Pope met with Native American leaders in Phoenix. He defended the legacy of the Franciscan missionaries he admitted that there had been some excesses. He also noted that the weight of the evidence indicated that Father Sarah had never been guilty of mistreating the Native Americans. Actually, he defended them from harm. The Pope then went to San Carlos Mission, Monterey Carmel, and prayed at Father Sarah's grave. He beatified Father Sarah on September 25, 1988, in St. Peter's Square. He praised Father Sarah as an exemplary model of selfishness, evangelizer, a shining example of the Christian, Christian virtue and the missionary spirit. A statue of Blessed Junipero Serra is in the National Statuary Hall in the U.S. Capitol building in Washington, D.C. A bronze statue of Sarah is mounted in Golden Gate Park in San Francisco. His name has been adopted by the lay organization known as the Sarah Club, which does much to foster vocations to the priesthood and religious life in the United States and other countries. Father Sarah died in 1784. Blessed Eugene Papero Serra, now on his final step to sainthood, witness to the holiness of the church as an ex ex extraordinary missionary. Serra is an exceptional example of the church's apostolic calling to preach and to witness the gospel to all people. He thus exhibited in the extraordinary way two of the four marks that characterized the church.